Hi, I'm Joe Cools from the Land of Enchantment, the state of New Mexico. Joe, if we were to travel to Albuquerque, what should we do while we're there? Give us some local travel tips. Well, in Albuquerque, there are many interesting places to visit, such as Petroglyphs National Monument, Coronado National Monument, Sandia Ski Resort, Historic Old Town, Kirtland Air Force Base, the National Atomic Museum, the Rio Grande River, Balloon Fiesta Park and Museum, the Indian Cultural Center, the Sandia and Manzana Mountains, Cibola National Forest, and Isla de Encendia Pueblos. If you could trade places with any famous explorer or world leader, who would you pick and why? Well, for an explorer, I think I'd pick Christopher Columbus because he explored the unknown and proved that there was something out there worth seeing. He discovered new lands and brought many unknown things back to the people of Europe. If someone gave you a free ticket to travel anywhere in the world, where would you go? Tell us what you would do while you were there and why you picked it. Well, I think I'd go to Italy because there are many famous and historical places to see there, and I have some distant relatives there too. In Italy, I would visit Venice where I could see St. Mark's Square and the Grand Canal. In Rome, I would visit the Colosseum, the Trevi Fountain, the Catacombs, the Roman Forum, the Vatican, and the Tiber River. In Naples, I would go see Mount Vesuvius, Pompeii, and the Isle of Capri. In Pisa, I would see the Leaning Tower of Pisa, and in Florence, I would go visit the Doma. Hey Nat Geo, do you know where the world's longest continuous tram is? From its highest point, it takes 7.8 seconds to fall to the ground, and it has many interesting rock formations around it, such as Fish Rock, Cannon Rock, and Totem Pole Rock.